so we have a little bit of a predicament. <laughs> oh dear. <laughs> this one was completely my fault. Okay guys, so as you can see, I'm here with my new CV500X and we've got a little bit of a predicament. I was supposed to set off to Scotland last night around 6, 7 p.m. And I was gonna go do the North Coast 500 because it's been on my bucket list for ages. And this year, like, I'm just like, you know what? I am gonna do everything I've always wanted to do. Nothing's gonna hold me back. And I've been wanting to do that for ages, so I'm gonna do it. And I didn't get around to fitting the luggage, so I haven't set off on the road. Oh gosh. But long story short, I was planning to get some kind of like semi-rigid panniers for this bike. I'm gonna do it completely different to Rocket. And I left it so last minute that it went out of stock. So then I didn't have any luggage to go to Scotland this weekend. I'm having a little bit of a freak out. I'm like, oh my God, what am I gonna do? I didn't really wanna do what I did at ABR, which was basically just Andy strap everything to my back. Can't be bothered with doing that to the North Coast 500. So did a little bit of a running around. <laughs> and long story short, I managed to get some brackets to fit my bike so I can put my old luggage on my new bike temporarily until the new luggage arrives so that I can still continue to travel. It's just not gonna look the best, but we're okay with that because you know what they say, function over form. I can live with it for a couple of weeks. So I've got this new bracket. We're gonna put the old luggage on. I don't have a top box bracket, so we still have to kind of manage somehow about the top box for the, for the week that I'm going up. Well, now it's less than two days, a week minus two days. And basically we need to fit it. <laughs> I'm just hoping there's instructions now. Those of you who have been following me for some time will remember the last time I tried to fit luggage to my bike. It went a little bit like this. I'm no expert, but I think I might have put my luggage on back to front. <laughs> I don't think it's supposed to go this way. Oh no. <laughs> oh, this is not going well for me at all. This is not going well for me. Why am I like this? What is wrong with me? <laughs> Do you know what the best part is? When I spoke to Shad Luggage at the bike show, they specifically said to me, I can't wait to see how you try and fit these on. And I was like, you know what, I'm going to show you. I'm going to show you that I can't fit them on. So yeah, that was a little bit of a disaster, but I'm feeling confident this time round. I, you know, I've, I've done it before. It's going to be great. I've, I've even managed to service my own bike minus the spark plugs now. So I think it's going to be like totes, totes fine. Uh, <laughs> it's all good. It's all good. It's going to be, it's going to be great. I'm going to do a stellar, stellar job. Ooh. So let's get cracking on. Have a look, instructions. Okay. That's upside down. <laughs> Take the seat off the bike. Oh, we can do that. That's not a hard task. Just pass it. Where did I put my key? What is this? Ah, oh, a little toolkit. What's this? 
What is that? What is that? What is that? What? Lift? What am I lifting? Right. So I'd met my first issue of the day, which was trying to get a bunch of bolts out. Right, I think this should be fine as long as we kind of get it off, right? Okay. Lefty loosey, righty tighty. Lefty loosey, righty tighty. Left. That's not working. Okay. Wait, 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 wait. Hang on. Is it righty tighty or lefty loosey? Eee! Okay. It's neither. I'm not strong enough. Okay. Ooh! Oh no! Everywhere. Ah. <gasps> oh. God damn it. Now this did prove somewhat difficult, mainly because the only tool I had was a hammer that I'd run over. Lefty Lucy. Ow. Am I doing this right? How are these? Oh, let's try this. No, it's not what I want. When in doubt, impact it out. <laughs> Absolutely just disregard that clip because that wasn't an impact talk. This is an impact talk. <laughs> oh. mm. Right. Despite finally preparing my bike, it still took me about two hours to figure out where the brackets were going to go. So I have been sat here losing my mind over this bracket, wholly convinced it's not the right bracket, fully convinced that there's something wrong, I must have gotten the wrong one, I'm like throwing everything back in the box like it's not going to fit and I am. Um, Notice these in the box, which just happened to uh, sit right there. <laughs> so yeah, that's the next plan of action. best DIY project so far. I didn't even break that many tools this time around so I'm quite happy with that. <laughs> 
Um, going forward, this is just a temporary measure. Like I said at the start of the video, until my soft luggage arrives, it is quite big and bulky, but I think it's gonna do fine for Scotland. Um, I, I'm gonna miss having a top box, but I'm gonna take a rucksack up with me as well. It'll be fine. Um, but yeah, I'm gonna tighten the screw up. I'm gonna sort out my car charger and also my heated gear, and then basically pack up so I can head off tomorrow around like eight, nine in the morning. But other than that, no, it's jobs are good, so I guess the only thing left to do is, uh, so I guess I'll see you guys next week. You'll see see what I get up to. <laughs> This one was completely my fault.